All right, check out this scam video that I saw here. It's an ad on Instagram. It has a nonsense name for the page. And I think that's Casey Hunt, if I'm not correct. Sorry about that. But if I hit play here, see, didn't never aired this. She never said these words. It's a deep fake AI audio video. Sensational news, a millionaire from Singapore. How did a guy at 19 become a multimillionaire in seven months? This story shook the whole world. People began to actively use his experience and repeat his success. Seven months ago, I started learning about cryptocurrencies and wanted to start making money. I only had $1,000 and I was very afraid of losing it. I decided to observe the open channel and every day I became more and more convinced of the profitability of this method. This is all a scam. the manager and he brought only 200 in the package he gave me training absolutely free. It took me about a week to learn, and after a week, I started. I don't know who he is. I invested the remaining $800 in trading, and in a week, I had more than $4,000 on my wallet. By the end of the month, my account was over $20,000. I followed the channel all day long and entered every recommended trade. Of course, I renewed my subscription and started multiplying. Why are they showing cash? Why would he have now cash? My account exceeds $15 million and continues to grow. I was poor and could not afford anything. Now I can get anything I want. Recently, the channel manager said that they want to close access for new subscribers and continue to help only those who are already in the channel. Sure. I will give you Makes a lot of sense. To spread this, and as many people as possible can become richer in this world. Since. News. Okay, sensational news. Uh, this is all a scam. It's all a deep fake scam. She has nothing to do with this. The guy, I don't know who he is. This goes to one of those chat.whatsapp.com group chats, a WhatsApp group chat. And those I've only ever seen associated with scams. I'm sure people have normal conversations in WhatsApp group chats all the time. I know WhatsApp is a big tool for people in certain parts of the world where they don't have maybe access to phone lines or something. And it's a very important tool for certain people to get in contact with family members long ways away. I get all that, whatever. But WhatsApp group chats are a breeding ground for scams. And this is just a crypto scam that eventually leads to a WhatsApp group chat. And they're going to try to convince you in there that you need to invest with them. They may even have a link to an app that shows you your investment is supposedly working. And all they're doing every time you give them money to supposedly invest is they're stealing your money. You're never going to see it again. And it's gone. You did not invest anything. You know, I'm not going to give you any crypto advice. I don't do crypto myself, but I know that I'm never going to give crypto away to people who are asking for it in a WhatsApp group chat. So I hope you found this helpful. This CNN deepfake thing is just the latest. There, there are so many. I, I, need, I need to make this very clear. There are so many scams in paid advertising on Meta's platforms, Facebook and Instagram, Messenger, Audience Network, whatever. They are accepting money from scammers at a scale that is not being reported about properly by anyone. And I'm talking about Meta. Meta will allow scams in their paid ads, despite what they might say on their PR page, Meta Newsroom or whatever. Talk is talk. What they're doing, you know, walk the walk, talk the talk, that sort of thing. What they're doing with their walk is that they are accepting money from scammers and they're not actually following what they claim to be doing, which is we're very serious about scammers. We have lots of different protocols and community standards and we have a team and around the world and it doesn't you're not doing anything. You're not doing a good job. I've seen thousands upon thousands of scams in paid ads in the last year. And every year I see tons every day. And I know that's partially because of the fact that I hunt scams and that's why I get them in my own feed. But that mean, that just means I see all the scams. I see all the ones that I can. And so there are too many out there. No one's ever going to do anything about it because Meta makes multi-billions of dollars every quarter or whatever, right? And who, who's going to tell them, hey, can you can you stop that and do, do a better job? No one. Like We don't live in a world where anything good like that is going to happen, unfortunately. There's hope for certain things, but not hope for Meta you know, Facebook and Instagram to ever become something that is totally a good thing and not a destructive thing. So got that off my chest. Watch out for this. Don't believe these scams. Don't fall for crypto scams. Don't fall for any scams. Be vigilant. Be careful. If you are pulling out your credit card or any other payment method to pay for something that five minutes ago you had no intention of paying for, and it's not like a trustworthy online store or something, then you might be getting sucked into a scam. If an online offer seems too good to be true, it probably is, right? And you're not going to find something that's truly, truly amazing in an ad on Facebook or Instagram. Sorry, that's not how that works. That's not how life works. Thank you for watching. Hit the like button, comment down below, subscribe, and there's a thanks button off to the right of the like button if you want to hit that. No one ever does. But when I get one of those, it makes my day. Thank you for watching.